thought I could have this plant on my desk. Like, would it look like I have plants on my desk? You think this look natural? I guess some things happened uh, in the last months. I could start tattooing again, which was great. And um, since I have been tattooing again, I haven't really taken the time to do any vlogs, even though I have been doing some things at home. Like you see in the background, I got myself a cricket, which is very exciting for me. Still like struggling a bit with it, but uh, I think it's getting better. Today I thought is a really good time to make a vlog because I have something that I am very excited about that I finally got the chance to make. Here's the big bag with the, the goods in it. So I ordered the wooden pins and charms that are gonna be earrings. And I haven't seen what they look like yet. I only saw some pictures that my tattoo colleague, she sent me. One sneak peek I took on one of the pins and I'm pretty excited to see the rest. So yeah, let's check it together. Okay, I'm so excited. Okay, first one. This was the one I already took a little sneak peek on. Oh my God. Look how cute is she? She's such a hottie. Came out so good, I think. This was exactly my hopes. So they're all made on wood and this one is like a light one. And we ordered some with uh, darker wood as well. So it's gonna be interesting to see. And they're like laser cut. I guess they like uh, make the print first and then the cut and then they have like this little protection layer on top. It's pretty satisfying, I must say. I'm a little bit more scared about coming ones because I know that one turned out a bit dark and it was a kind of more of a last minute one also. Oh my god, yes! I think this came out very cool. Try to make a little bit something for everyone. So this is more, if you want something more traditional, more beautiful. The cow is maybe more cute and funny. Yeah, I'm happy about this also. Can't wait to peel all of these actually. I'm glad I have a bit of nails now, so that will help. Wow, it feels so good to peel them. And it has like a rubber backing on the back. You could choose if you wanted to have a metal or a rubber, but I think rubber is nice because it doesn't scratch you if you want to use it on a sweater or something. And it's a bit more tight, I think. <laughs> I mean, it's very tight. I can't even get it off right now. So yeah, that's... Oops. Awesome. Okay, so those were pretty much safe and, and now for the earrings. This is like charms, so you could do anything you want. You could do like key rings or something, but I'm gonna do some earrings with them is my hope. Ooh. I mean, hmm. I think they're cool. What do you think? Maybe I should turn this light on here. They're pretty dark. But honestly, I think it's my fault. I think I made them this dark. But I think for uh, like a jewelry, it's pretty good. Nothing too crazy. And I like that it has these cutouts. It makes it pretty fun. And the size is good, I think. It's a bit bigger than I personally wear. But uh, yeah, I can't wait to see them with the earrings on also. Okay, last one. It really has a special smell. I don't know if it's the... From the laser it must be a little bit like burnt candle <laughs> okay this might be my favorite look at these it's the moths and these are gonna be earrings as well i really like these just thinking now because i see the back side and it's like looking like this that maybe i should paint the back side black or something or is it also wait am i stupid yes i am stupid Okay, the backside looks awesome. <laughs> cool, okay, I'm very happy with this.
So I had kind of a little panic situation yesterday with the earrings and actually went to some shops and tried to find a substitute for these rings but ultimately I didn't find anything that was good enough so now I decided okay the pins first and I will get the good stuff for the earrings so that I can yeah I can release them later but um, I think that's okay for now so the pins will be out and uh, yeah yesterday me and my boyfriend uh, fixed all the cows Actually, even more of her here. There's so many, actually. <laughs> I even got some extras, so that's super cool. And there was only one that I thought was really like a B-grade one. Maybe I have to check them again now when it's a better light today. But um, here was my little test that I made at home. Just to print out and see how she would look like. And uh, then the finished product. And it's so cool to see how it came alive. Yeah, and for the backing cards, I had just ordered some craft paper from Amazon. And uh, it worked really well. So right now I didn't have time to make anything more complicated than this. But I kind of like the simplicity of it. Today I'm gonna do the same thing with these guys and uh, take some photos and hopefully I will get them out today or tomorrow so Rule of defamation I mean he's Trump he's like Trump wannabe well, Trump doesn't drink hoping dead mind sends me to cease and desist to see if it gets claimed this morning to do a photo shoot and here are both of them how they came out got them uh, stacked in these boxes ready to go my only worry right now is how to pack them and send them because Germany has a bit weird rules when it comes to sending stuff like you're only allowed to send documents in a letter so you would have to have a package to send a small thing like this which of course makes it instantly more expensive but yeah I gotta have to figure that out also how to keep them safe it came with some kind of cool like this uh, paper bubble wrap and I think you can get this at the post office at least you can get it online so I have to check that out yeah my big struggles are to like calculate the postage make it as cheap as possible so that people will still feel like they can buy it and still make it according to the rules, yeah. Uh, so now I'm gonna sit down and edit the photos for the Etsy listings and for the Instagram and hopefully by 6 or 7 tonight I can put up a post and uh, they will already be out, so that's the plan for this evening. keeping up with the video making I haven't been feeling like being in front of a camera or doing anything uh, anything <laughs> I don't know this winter is making me like really get this seasonal depression back when I was living in Sweden I used to have it a lot and Germany has been like way better but this winter has been really also snowy and dark in Germany as well although snow is nice it just brings me back to this uh, yeah 
this not so nice place. So I've been kind of not very productive. I feel like when the sun goes down, this is like the end of my day, which is very early so far. And I don't know, just not feeling it, being in front of the camera, thinking about who might watch it later or yeah, just an uncomfortable feeling. But um, on the other side, I need to tell myself that um, to just not give a fuck. So here I am. And uh, yeah, um, I really want to make more videos and I want to make uh, and share more of what I do. I also want to do more because honestly, there's not been that much worth documenting in my opinion the last few weeks because of my state of apathy <laughs> so yeah but about the pins um yeah this went all well i guess i was expecting a bit more sales than i got but i still think it's a cool thing to have in my shop as well as in the tattoo studio it's a very nice small thing you can pick up when you are having your appointment even though the launch was not that successful in terms of numbers I still would like to do more of them and um, the earrings I have not gotten to yet so maybe in the spring I will get to them. Mm. Yeah I kind of just wanted to wrap this vlog up. Yeah I hope you enjoy the process. If you have any questions you can uh, leave a comment and if you want to see more you can subscribe. I'm not sure if I mentioned the company that we order from is called Zap Creatives so I will leave a link as well in the comments that you can find them not sponsored or anything. Yeah, and uh, I hope you enjoy this vlog and see you hopefully a bit sooner next time. Shall we?